Hello everyone, my name is Elizabeth Finlay, I'm the Director of Queensland College of Art. The College is very proud to be hosting the finalist exhibition of the Elaine Birmingham National Watercolour Prize. We have entrants from all over the country celebrating the medium of watercolour and the genre of landscape painting. This year the exhibition includes artists from all around the country and of course takes place during a very difficult year when artists have been in lockdown and when they have been facing incredible challenges. So the achievement of the artists in this exhibition is all the more impressive and I want to congratulate all of the finalists and indeed all the entrants into the exhibition. I'm very grateful to the judge, Samantha Littley, for taking on this very challenging role of selecting a winner from this excellent exhibition. Well, I'm Pamela, I'm Elaine's niece, and uh, sadly Elaine passed away in 2014 before she saw her first exhibition, and uh, she would be extremely proud of what's happening here today. She was very passionate about art, especially watercolour. She felt watercolour was uh, very underestimated and would like to see it promoted. And that's why she made her donation, hoping it would help up and coming artists. In her early 20s, Elaine felt that she had more opportunity in America. So she traveled to America and establishing a business called the Kangaroo Club. She ended up being there for 30 years. And if she hadn't been so successful in a man's world too, she would have done more painting as a hobby. She never lost the passion for artwork and always dabbled when she could. She was always hoping to help up and coming artists, which she did in her very early years and has wanted to do that ever since, which is what this exhibition is all about. Elaine would be extremely happy with the results of this to see so many people interested in putting in artwork and knowing that someone will be getting something to help them along their way to be a famous artist.